It's weird. What, your penis? No. Oh. Um, the Emmy nominations were in July. Mm. But the Emmy, Emmy ceremony is happening January 15th. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> yep. The announcements were in July for nominations, but the award ceremony doesn't happen until January 15th. <laughs> Whoa! Just... Hey, welcome back to our stupid ranks. I'm Corbin. I'm Randy. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, or juicy content. Thank you, everybody, for some Patreon folks. So the guns have like button. Today we got a trailer, and this actually dropped a few months ago. Missed it, but it apparently just came out on OTT, um, and it's a Tamil film. Uh, it's called Chita. I mean, it came out in this year. Uh, a thriller film about a uh, starring Siddharth, Siddharth and Nimisha Sajian, written and directed by S. U. Arun Kumar. Um, a lot of people say. It's their favorite of the year. That's uh, saying a lot. Yeah, yeah. So, um, you guys, obviously, if you've seen it, you can let us know if this is one we should watch before the end of the year. To obviously, we, I always try at the in December to be like get to anything that we missed that everybody's like, oh, this is and amazing. was a big one. That... Obviously, last year I missed <laughs> every film. I guess that was good last year, <laughs> especially in the Malayalam industry. Uh, it's, it's probably our biggest miss. Oh. As that's, we've seen the films from last year and realized, damn, there were a ton we missed. There were at least three or four that would have been. But hey, in my top what are you going to do? Five. It happens. Um, and I don't know what I would have done. India makes a lot of movies. But uh, those three specifically. Were yeah. Those were something right up our alley. But anyway, this one's Tamil. Uh, so you guys let us know uh, what you think about this one. And we will talk to you after we watch the trailer. We will. Maybe. Maybe not. We've never done that. We should just watch the trailer and say bye. And just... that would be a stupid reaction. I've seen reaction channels that do that. They just watch it. Well, and they'll, then... they'll watch something and they're like, oh, that was cool. Let us know what else you guys want. <laughs> okay. So they're literally just reacting and then have nothing to say after the fact. Hey, man, that's yeah. what apparently people want. <laughs> we get told all the time. It was hey, like... but someone asked me, I don't know, if you, do you talk to Jabby much? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Well, not much, but I, wanna... I talk to Jabby. We'll do a collaboration with him. What the heck? <laughs> I don't know, man. Why doesn't he want to do it? <laughs> Jabby! No, I don't know if he pick does. Pick it. You pick, you pick the movie. You pick the thing that we can do a collab on. Buddy. We'll do it on your channel. All right. We don't care. I Come don't... on, Jabby. I don't know, man. <laughs> I know, it's weird. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I just talk to the man. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I have no ill will towards Jabby. Do not start that. Yes. I'm liking the vibe already, though. I was just going to say something. Great trailer. Well, damn. Great trailer. Um, I'm sorry, Miss. I I don't know if it, it came here at all. I don't know. Um, 
if it, odds are if it did at the time at least i did not get messages right at least in plethora that i registered yeah um which happens but man does that look good that looks really good one of the standout things obviously always looking out for elevative artistry and one of the most ele Take elevative shot. elevative things you can do in in you cinematic storytelling steals your child that's it no it, in, in cinematic storytelling is obviously the, the basic foundation for that is show don't tell but when you see a trailer that pays very close attention to small things the movement of a finger yeah that was cool the look of an eye yeah the tilt of a head when those are accentuated in the trailer that is a big giant hi everybody from the director telling you this is going to be that kind of film it's going to be a film that focuses on the smallness of things on the symbolism of things and you want to watch every single moment of of film and that the acting is going to be rooted and grounded in reality and believability so that is all of the hallmarks of the kind of movie that floats our boat big time and um it's head starring um her yes yeah, who we have indian kitchen, great indian kitchen Malik, yep and uh great Nayatu actress and a couple other i believe a couple other things yeah uh very anything good. we've seen her in but she's uh, been stellar uh, have we seen her in anything tamil because uh, ah good question i think the, all those other ones i believe correct me if i'm wrong are malayalam um obviously it's not unheard of to go in between industries no of obviously yes uh, fafa does it obviously everybody um pretty much everybody does it you know, work is work right yeah and exactly work is work and and movies are movies um but it looked really good uh so i'd be quite intrigued to uh to see it it's just, so it had its theatrical it should be streaming now yes yeah i believe because i got sent it a lot now because i think it just it got just to dropped streaming. okay so maybe even more people saw it and then are now recommending cool uh, so, so you guys can let us know if this is one we should watch before the end of the year so we can uh, give it some yeah, legs and put in the uh yeah maybe the dummies um it's gonna be a interesting year it's gonna be a very interesting year um but oh man and if you're wondering about things internationally the short list uh, as we're filming this right now the short list for the international film for the oscars is in about 10 days uh, it's December 21st. Um, Don't hold your India breath. won't be on the short list. Don't hold your breath. Um, <laughs> Not that I know. I haven't talked to any Academy members who I, I just... I'd put money down on it, though. I would, too. Um, A lot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, if, if you would have put maybe LGP, so? Well, we've got... A few that we could have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but that's a that's yeah, a horse of a different color. Yeah. They, uh, it's only that's only two hours, right? Oh, uh, two twenty. Two twenty. Two twenty. Um, I wonder where it's streaming. The, the uh, other thing that's always wonderful to see, not that there's anything wrong with a different writer, especially adaptation. That happens a lot where you have a different writer and a, and a director. But when you see a writer and director, that's often oftentimes very telling in terms of the passion of the director to be putting something up uh, it's oftentimes a very big passion project for them compared to some other things not not always the case but i it's always exciting to see written and directed by looks like it might be on who, doesn't mean I, it's any better can, necessarily who i can never trust something to go on there and i was like no it's not actually here it's on prime though for, oh yeah for no rent. Too many times it says it's on Prime. That doesn't mean Jack. Yeah. You know, um, Google lies about what's streaming on what platform when all the time. They I'm they all about uh, movies that um, kill I know. people that do stuff to children. Yeah. Uh, this will be hard watch because the like the animal instinct that just comes out of me. If I put myself in that situation, yeah. The, 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 as I refer to it as flipping the switch, like oh, it's like yeah. it's instantaneous just watching it. Yeah, because like if I'm walking with my kid and like I've seen videos of like in I think it's other countries, um, somebody like comes up to this dad and tries to take a kid out of the father, like out of his hands and like abduct him, and I'm like, yeah, I don't, I, I know what I would do because like it would like it would take half a millisecond. For me to go into yeah. primal mode well, and literally beat the living shit out of anybody trying to touch my children. And that doesn't change <laughs> when they become adults. That doesn't change. No. Anytime we watch something recently, and I may review it on my stupid movie reviews on my channel, there's a Netflix documentary, because Andrani and I love documentaries. It's 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 about 
I believe the title of it is Escaping Twin Flames, and it's about a cult that presently exists here in the United States. By the way, there's 10,000 cults, at least, in the United States. That's a staggering statistic. And not all of them are the church. But (laughs) but, um, in it, there's a couple of stories of, of moms who saw their adult children be taken into this cult by the guy who is the leader of this cult. And as is often the case, and Johnny turned to me and she'd say, what would you do if that was Ashley, Alexis, or Micah? I said, well, I'd, that'd be a flip the switch kind of yeah. moment for me. Yeah, yeah. Because cause what, what, what was done to these people. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. if a person's stronger than I am, that, that's one thing, but like every ounce of... Anger and power would come out of me. Yeah, instantaneously. The only th- the only things that stop me from doing those kinds of things, obviously, are there's a, they're manifold. But there's a woman in an Italian courtroom. You've probably seen the real, who her the man on trial had raped and killed her child, mm-hmm. and she came into the courtroom with a gun and just shot him to death with mm-hmm. six shots. And there's a there's footage of it. She just walks in and she goes, and she's like, I regret nothing. <sighs> Yeah, but then you're in prison for the rest of your life. Well, I think, uh, I don't know what story it was. It was a similar story. Uh, this lady, something similar happened to her kids, raped and k- killed or something God, like that, gee. right? Um, and then she, I don't know if it was her husband, a relative, a random person, she killed him. And then so she got sentenced to something for, for murder. Right. And er, she, on her way out into jail, the reporters were like, so do you regret anything? No, happiest day of my life. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, more power to you. I hope you serve a light sentence because that is justice in my eyes. Uh, like, you, it should be allowed for like, if you do something to children, like the parents have 10 minutes. Yeah, let the parents be the ones to in enforce the, the punishment. For 10 minutes punishment. with no security. <laughs> yeah. That's what should happen. Let, let the parents enforce the punishment. Yeah, I agree. Anyways, uh, let us know about this film. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, if something we should watch, let us know. Without spoilers, of course, down below. Josh! <laughs>